Let the rhyme style games begin. I lose. I lose. Never abandon your conviction. Get sealed, buddy. You too have the same strength in your heart. But you've lost it, and you will never be able to defeat me. Conviction? Heart? Once, I had it too. But I have it... no longer. I don't have a heart because I'm dead. You... have never lost it. You never lost your heart because you're alive. What decided this battle? <laughs> Incredible. All right, that's two victories. He's facing a powerful opponent in Hanzo, Lord Mifune. Report from General Mifune in the Fifth Company. They've successfully defeated Hanzo. He did it. I knew Mifune wouldn't fail. And I was right. Yeah. Alright. Let's keep going. Let us keep going. Uh, third company, I guess. Doesn't give me that many options. Good. It looks like the Ninja Alliance holds the advantage for now. Shikaku reports in from other battlefields. The second company, led by Kitsuchi, has successfully annihilated the enemy. They are moving to the next objective. I see. We have a report as well. Enemy forces have drawn near the third company and are now right in front of them. The battle will soon be underway. Kakashi, don't let us down. I like how this part of the game makes it look like you get to choose which fights you want to do, but you you don't. You play as either Mifune or you jump into this fight as Kakashi. So that, I always kind of find that funny. It's like if you're gonna add an aspect of the game that's a little bit different, like like that, for example. Where you get to choose which ba battlefield you want to experience, then you should have done that. Not just, you know, make us like breathe through all the battles and then choose only only two. Everyone is in place. Yeah. How close is the enemy? Pakun and the others are investigating that now. Only they can't be very far away. Then it's almost time, isn't it? Do not be afraid, Sakura. I shall protect you, even if I must die in the process. Thank you, Lee. <gasps> Kakashi! Battle groups with sensory... Super friends on Lee. The other members cover 12, 3, 6, and 9 o'clock positions in standard Manji formation. Mist. And... Is this cold air? Kakashi-sensei, isn't this... Yup. Yeah. I never thought I'd be reunited with you in a place like this, Zabuza. Hmm. If you're here, it must mean that kid's here too. Seriously, it would be a lot more fun to like fight all the, uh, the, the Zetsus. The demon and that child with the ice style. I knew I would have to fight, but I never imagined it would be against you, Kakashi. That day on the bridge, you were supposed to finish me off and send me to hell. But when I came to, I was with Haku. I thought it was strange, but this place seems neither heaven nor hell. This is the world of the living. It's not a place for you anymore. Zabuza, Haku. Ah, you've grown up. Kakashi's little Kunoichi. And is that other lad still doing well? Huh? He's aight. Yes. He's kind of the reason why this war started. Zabuza. Thanks to the two of you, Naruto was able to discover his ninja way. At your grave. He pledged to follow it. He's grown to be a splendid ninja. Well then, 
Now he shall get even stronger. Kakashi, you understand what will happen to us now, don't you? We must battle. This body is nothing but a puppet. Use your power on us. Talked enough? I need you to get to work now. You must stop us. Zabuza. Kakashi, I beg of you. You must stop us again. My dream was to die an instrument of Zabuza. The fact that Zabuza is also here under the influence of this jutsu means I failed to protect him from you that day. And now, not only can I not protect Zabuza, I cannot even do his bidding. No. You did indeed protect Zabuza. You did everything you could. He died from a different cause. Plus, Zabuza never thought you were a tool to use for his destructive whims. Kakashi, don't you say another word. Zabuza. I remember that day. It was my first defeat ever. Kakashi, don't hold back. Use whatever means necessary to stop me. Remember, I am already dead. And I died human. Yes. I know. Thank you, Zabuza. Rise. But that's another reason why I don't like the whole Edo Tensei thing, because you can just bring anybody back, like, whenever. Oh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and bring back everybody. It just, I don't know, I feel like with everything else, the Naruto story was awesome, but I feel like just one part of it, how they brought everybody back for the purpose of the war was just, it was just kind of a cop-out slash cheap way to do it. And I feel like if you can do Edo Tenzo, it has to be some kind of great restraint for it. Like, if you bring back somebody and they die, then you die, or some kind of exchange. But it's like, at this point, it's just way too overpowered. Way too overpowered. All right. Let the battle begin. Let's fight Zabuza once again. Do a little quick uh, charge inside. Make one of these, go upward. Get wrecked, buddy. Oh, no, no, I didn't mean to do that. I actually meant to um, sub out of that, but uh, this works too. Although I don't have uh, Sakura to help me right now. Do this. Do some uh, regular circle combos like that. Yeah. Spin my mixtape at him. This battle is going to be pretty easy. Game over. Oh, come on! He stopped me just in time. This is the end. Here we go. That should do it. That should do it. That should do it. Yeah! Kamui! No place here now. Salvos. Kamui! Game over! Yeah, become nothing. And then something again. Alright, that's another victory for the Ninja Alliance! Getting one step closer to the actual beginning of the war. This is just kind of stuff to do with beginning. What did I just unlock? I thought I already had everything in this game unlocked. I wasn't paying attention. Um. But whatever. All right. Apparently, I don't have everything unlocked in the game. I didn't know that. Uh, what do we got? Actually, I think what we just got was ah, uh, whatever. It doesn't matter. I'll just rewind the video and just check it out myself. But for now, we shall keep going. Unbelievable. Kakashi, those are... Yeah, they're the Hidden Mist Village's most brutal unit. The previous seven ninja swordsmen of the mist.
See, like, literally, they brought back everybody. Like, that's my problem with the story. This, just this part of the story. Everything else is great, but this part is just like, yeah, let's just bring back everybody. Don't worry about them. I'll take them. Of course, Kakashi is after Zabuza and Haku, then. He must have known them quite well. Also, Kabuto is a dick. Make sure they give him a good fight. Guy, I'm counting on you. Yeah. Now then, our opponents are those six ninja. Our opponents are those six ninja. Yeah, just fight them. They're very skilled at jutsu. If we waste time fooling around, we'll just increase our losses. This has to be a quick battle. Now everyone attack at once. Lee. We're doing a legendary route here. We couldn't. It's too dangerous to take on all those powerful ninja at once. Oh, well, we're gonna do it. it Shut up, Sakura. Separate them as much as possible and then attack one at a time? Nope. All once. All once. Legendary. We're doing legendary. Oh, I don't even get to choose, do I? I don't remember. I swear you. Oh, okay. That was about seven. Like I remember. I thought I remember. Get to do all of them. I know that it's a little crazy, but we can't take our time with this. We're gonna use do all it. ones. How did this fight actually even Sorry. go? I don't remember. I understand how you feel, but even though it seems crazy, attacking all at once is gonna minimize casualties in the end. No, it won't. I feel like if you fight them one by one, it would just be like a lot easier. There's nothing we cannot do if we join forces. Very well. But please consider retreating if it gets really dangerous. I know, but right now we should focus on victory. Let's go. Right. Yes, sir. This part right here was where you fight everybody at the same time, wasn't it? Like literally at the same time, like Dynasty Warrior style. I don't remember. It's been a while. But also I like how CZ2, when they did uh, Storm 3, I, I don't think they did in Storm 2 from what I remember. But in Storm 3, they added like different fight styles, like where you just kind of roam around and fight soldiers and stuff. I thought it was interesting to see that they tested that out. The Seven Swordsmen are quite the opponents, but I'm, I'm not, not gonna lose. lose. Let the battle begin. <laughs> All right, let's fight him. Watch out for Genie Nakabino. His blade covers the body to help it splinter. Come on, get up, get up, get up, get up. He's quite the formidable. Finish him off. He should be almost dead. No, 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 no. Ah, oh, I, I forgot that the lock-on system was was really stupid. Like Let your guard down. Don't get hit. Don't hit. Get hit. Okay, we got. Okay, we got steel. We got steel. Scott, come here. Is it a? Hey. Right, we got one. One down. Six. Five more to go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's do this. 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 There we go. Hey. Hey. Hey, let's go. Excellent. Excellente. Press circle, press circle, what are you doing? There we go. Defeat him. That's two down. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. There's more. Three down. See, this wasn't that bad. I like how this part is so over-exaggerated too. Like, oh, this part is really, really hard. No, it's not. It's literally just easy. Look, look. Also, CC2, if you ever do this again in the future, it would help if you add like a lock-on system. I think Revolution did a great job in uh in doing this part. Like team battles and stuff. Although, I don't prefer doing team battles in the future. It wasn't that much fun. Press circle. There we go. All right. Easy victory. Also, it would have been kind of nice if he had a different uh, animation on every single kill, too. What a fierce battle. But, but we won. We won.